guys welcome back to the channel so first of all just log in with your credentials and activate the cloud shell this lab is very easy but too much time consuming so please be patient while doing this lab now just simply come on the task number one and copy this first command and run over here then copy this second command and run now this command is going to take a couple of minutes so please be patient while completing this task So this command executed properly. Now just simply scroll down, copy this start command and run over here. Okay, now we have done with the task number one. Now just simply scroll down for the task number two. What we have to do, we have to just create one registry or you can say repository. So just copy this and come over here and search for the artifact registry. Okay, so open this thing in new tab. Just wait over here and click on this plus icon, paste the name which you copy from the lab instruction. The format must be docker and for the region choose US central one like this and simply click on create. So we are done with this task. Now just simply scroll down, copy this command. Okay, go back to your dashboard and here just press control C to terminate this task. So just as you can see, we have terminate from here. You can just check press ctrl c now what you have to do just paste that command which you copy from the lab instruction this command okay now here it's asking like do you want to continue so just press y and hit enter now copy this command okay first of all just copy this command and this might happen with you you might forget to run any particular command so please be patient while doing this lab okay so now just copy this first command and run over here click on authorize now just wait for to this command get executed it will take a couple of seconds and it's finished now just copy this second command and run over here now this command is going to take a couple of minutes so please be patient and just wait for to this command get executed
and it's finished now just simply scroll down and click on check my progress you will get a score without any issue now for the task number three just copy this command run over here wait for a second and it will ask like do you want to continue so just press y and hit enter now this is going to take a couple of seconds so please be patient and it's finally done now just simply scroll down and click on check my progress you will get a score without any issue okay do not worry about that error lab take couple of minutes to update a score so just simply scroll down and come on the task number four copy this command and run over here just wait until this command get executed it will take a couple of seconds and if you want you can just simply scroll up and click on check my progress for task number three this time you will get a score without any issue. As I said, lab take couple of minutes to update the score. Now just wait for to this command get executed. Then we have to just run this command. Okay. So this command is executed. Now just click on check my progress. And meanwhile copy this command. Copy this command and run. And here on the task number 4, sometimes it takes time to update a score. So do not worry about that thing. Okay. Now once this command is executed, we are going on the task number 5 so just copy this command and just wait for to this command get executed and it's done now run the first command of task number 5 okay no need to run this second command just simply come on the task number command number 3 just copy this and run now just wait until this command get executed and it's finally done now run the fourth command of task number five and just wait until this command get executed and this command also execute properly now just simply click on check my progress you will get a score without any issue now we have to just run this command and we are done with the task number six also so just copy this and run
and it's also done now if you just check the score for the task number six you will get a score without any issue and that's the way we have to complete this lab if you still have any doubts please let me know in the comment section guys thanks for watching and have a good day